looking at using OG Ryu for this matchup against Momochi. Well, he lost so badly in Topanga A-League to Momochi. It was the only time in the whole Topanga A-League where Daigo was just completely blown away. Um, I'm not surprised he's decided not to go with that, because the biggest deal is your pokes just aren't quite as fast as yeah, Ryu. And you that can't play seven that frame crouch and medium kick against a four frame crouch and medium kick. It's a big kick. deal, it's a big yeah. deal. Wow, what a start from Momochi. I think despite Daigo's recent come to form, this is still the best Street Fighter player in the world at the moment. I saw him lose to Gustavo at final round. Nevertheless. Look at this relentless pressure here from Momochi. Kara focus punish, beautiful. Sweet. Wake up back throw lands with Daigo and he just wants to play a Bible game. Both these guys got their ultra stocks. Gotta be careful with those untrue block strings. I'm just waiting on a forward hard punch from Daigo, it's coming. It's been a while since we've seen Daigo's Ryu in action. I'm really, really thrilled to see it back. But Momochi looking good right now. Yeah, with those folks. Wow, four in a row. Knocks them down. Just again, just choosing to continue the fireball pressure. Daigo's got the bars to cancel the EX into Oh, lovely Ultra. step kick. Oh, but he's not going to get a chance to do it. Just that caught him kick. stepping. Such a good poke, that. Not yeah. really utilized enough by Kens. Sengan uh, rinses it. It's really good when you're looking for other options, when you're looking Lots for sweep, looking for step kick, looking for crouch and medium kick. That hard kick is very good. See the tap tap into the medium punch there. Oh, oh. buddy! It was the right idea. Too far away. Oh, oh. Well, there I go. The, kid, the, the Ryu just not. Oh, huge drop. Oh, and another oh, drop. Word. It's been too long. And no matter what you say, even if you're a Momochi fan, you do not want to see anyone losing like that. No. Daigo dropping a one-frame link off Although the Although, to be fierce. fair, Momochi had the same thing literally a second yeah. earlier. Daigo so. didn't punish with Ultra. Yeah. And that's just that familiarity, that, that, that muscle memory that when you're playing Ryu regularly, you do naturally. He's got a very short amount of time to, to get his Ryu back to where it was here versus Momochi. He's going to stick with him, though. Uh, I'm not sure if these are three out of five yet. We are in top eight, so... This top eight. Sure. Completely unsafe that. I'll try and get some confirmation on that for you. Hopefully they are, because I want to see these guys for playing as long as possible. I got playing a really solid fireball game right now. Well, Momochi hasn't lost too much health in the, even though he's been at the he's been on the receiving end more so. Nice anti-air. Wake up jab, that's clever. Anticipating some kind of delay, and it was the case. Nice focus. Stuffs that fireball with a step kick. No punish on that DPF ADC forward. Oh! Wow, the luck is not with Daigo today. I think that was a brilliant idea. But the counter hit actually pushed Ken back, causing the Shoryu to whiff completely. That's a massive turning point in this round. Oh, once he then lands a, cr a count hit crouching medium. Like has got the meter to bring this back, but it's a long way. I think one hit and he's back in this. Oh, once he's just trying to stalk him out. Oh, oh nice fireball. Good approach there from Momochi. Daigo effect DCs. Gets a slight chip. Oh, oh my word, this is so intense. One EX will take it. This guy's just fireballing the hell out of each other right now. Oh, oh nice block. Oh, and he gets him in the step, what kick. A step kick. He went for the EX. He knew that would have taken it. That was so clever. He got him with the with the overhead blocked. Took a little step back and hesitated as if he wasn't going to do anything. Then the step kick counter hit the EX fireball. Again, opens up the round, focusing through a fireball. What's a start from Momochi? It is match point. Is this domination over Daiko going to continue? Great fireball game here from Daigo. Slow swings down. Gotta be careful. Watch out for those jumps. Another well spaced fireball. Oh, what a conversion from Daigo Umehara. He's back in this. What a round so far. But what she's so keen to finish it off. But ran into too many fireballs. Then a counter hit crouch medium. Oh, lovely use of the standing light kick. Very similar to what he was doing against Luffy earlier, isn't yeah. it? Oh, oh, my oh, word. Oh. He could have gone straight he into Ultra there. He could have actually gone into Ultra 2 there. You're right, exactly. Counter hit. 
last one once you got something planned. Oh, wow. Strong what, man from Daigo, very strong. Alright, he saves himself one match point. It's still match point for Mochi though. Uh, I'm not entirely sure because it might be three out of five. Stop okay. Eight, so. Okay, let's wait and see. We, we're not too sure. I think that's Capcom Pro Tour standards. It is, it is first of three. Okay. Confirmed. I did believe that was the Capcom Pro Tour rules and that is... Daigo hesitating to do the DP that time, understandably. Off it whiff completely. I feel like that little me up here. Great corner control here from Daigo. Standing in that race, but Lovely again, focus. a very clever focus from Mochi. Wake up, jab again. The reads on point here. He's having tremendous success with those focus dashes. He's not gone for any kind of mix up on Ken's knockdown as well. He's just played the ground game, which I'm not sure is the right choice for this reason. Oh no, FADC. Should have just been a normal fireball. FADC forward, Ultra 2. Would have probably taken the round. Momochi, unlike Daigo, choosing to apply pressure on the knockdown. That builds up a substantial life lead. Just gonna wait out, builds a meter. Oh my word, so intimidating this. Sticking out that medium kick. The Momochi's not even biting trying to whiff punish that medium kick at all. He's happy to just let that whiff. Oh, oh knockdown! Good nice block on the overhead. Block on that overhead. Oh, Momochi son! Oh, baby! Sick. When it mattered the most, he knew that fireball was coming. He's really got a great read ready. at that exact range as well. Mm. Daigo going for fireball so often at that range, and he's had so much success with the focus at that range. Just buffering that ultra, he was ready. As soon as he saw the flash, hit those buttons, that Ultra 2 came out, took the match, he's 2-0 up and looking very comfortable. So good. Oh, oh. my word, Bomochi. Knocked down for Daigo. Finally an approach on a Ken's knockdown. I think that was just to get out of the corner, to be honest Indeed. with you. Oh, oh lovely foot seeing. Oh! oh! Yes! Bomochi on fire! <laughs> oh! All press buttons! Wow. Daigo going for the wake up jab about four or five times prior to that. Momochi anticipating just going for a meaty close medium kick. Counter hitting immediately. Daigo must have gone for that meaty jab again. Didn't come off. Fantastic play. Oh, he gets him in the Kara DP. Oh my word, Into Momochi everything. on fire. I mean, Literally. You can do three DPs here. On counter hit, yeah, you get the juggle, you get an extra juggle point. He's really fo he can't really focus against Daigo like this. Wow, I just played a backlash. Oh, misses oh. an FADC. Again, though, sure you cancel on that crouch medium, on that focus. Match point Momochi now. I go bringing this round back. Gets counter hit. Oh, what a chase down. Did he OS that? With I think he just forward. Forward. Oh, that goes back in it. Is that the be solar enough? plexus lands. He's done it. Yes. He's still alive. I've been waiting for that solar plexus for about six rounds. It's just such a scary thing to stick out because the startup is so long. You don't want to get counter hit by anything, but he did it at the perfect time there. The thing is, he's, he's focusing forward. So look. Wow. Who may show you? Ooh. Nice crouch fierce. He's changing up his pressure as well. I was just going to say, every time he does a crouch, oh, medium it. kick, empty, then goes for a fireball, he's getting counter hit by the step kick. He's been doing crouch, medium kick, then crouch, medium kick again, it's working. But that time he went for the fireball again and got counter hit by the step kick one more time. What a turnaround there from Daigo, looking far more, more, more like himself. Converting his links. DP, and yeah. with crouch, fierce punch earlier. Oh, wow, what wants he just yes. do it? And he's knocked him down. Here we, go. we saw this with Reinhardt. Daigo, oh, go run! Crouch medium kick! <laughs> Daigo with another ultra hit confirmed to stay alive. What a risky, that was tournament point. Oh if he'd have done days. anything meaty, he would have been dead. Ooh. What a read from Daigo. And he literally just got counter hit for doing a wake up yeah. normal earlier. So that was that was one hell of a read. He knew he was gonna go into that car for a game. Caught him standing. Watch your toes. Daigo Umahara back in this set. Focus battles, middle of the screen. 
Mochi so intimidating with his face and he's walking. That walk speed for Ken, such a humongous buff. Such he really needed buff, that. Definitely. And I think it makes sense. Ken was always supposed to be the faster he's of the two. He's supposed to be the fast, exactly the so fast aggressive one. It's so frustrating for him to, be so, to have been so slow prior to this. Daigo really controlling this game now. Oh, look at that. In front again. Hit. <laughs> Daigo goes oh, back to the well, the original guaranteed chip. Oh, beautiful. Nice sweep. Really nice sweep. Good answer. That's a big buff as well for Ryu, the change in pace. He's got the slower light fireball and the faster fierce fireball. I think that's a tremendous buff for him, to be honest with you. It really makes the um, wow. evil Ryu matchup very exciting for, for, for Ryu. And once you're not playing as um, carefully as your support, he's building a need to try and insert some authority here. Not coming off. Daigo defending well and actually takes a life lead from once he attacks him. Good block on the double hit. Nice throw. Nice power grab. Oh, oh, oh. There it is again, the crouching fierce. It answers all the jumpings that Ken will try to do on you. Yeah, he's, Daigo's got such great spatial awareness, that range, knowing that the jump in from that range will lose regardless of what Ken does. Daigo actually hasn't altered for any fireballs yet. Nice whiff punish from uh, Momochi. Daiko starting to insert, apply some pressure now. <laughs> Momochi not Wait interested in any of that. Look at this spacing from Momochi. Is he outputs he in Daiko right now? I think he is. Oh, too good. Heading towards another match point. Oh, oh, wolf, wolf, I thought bro. he was going to do Daiko. for DP. I was so sure. Block. Jumps out of there. Not interested. Oh, no ultra. Oh. Daiko has him cornered here. Yes! No! Yes! Oh, yeah. Coming. I'm sick, bro. <laughs> Told you, walk forward DP was coming all day. As soon as he got in that range, as soon as he got in that range. Oh, when was the last time you saw Daigo do that? That takes me back to when I first started I love seeing this Daigo. This Daigo, I love this Daigo. Crouching oh. medium kick, axe kick Daigo. I want to see this Daigo. I couldn't agree more. Walk Just in your face, wait three frames for you to think you need to press something. So delayed. DP. So delayed. And he had no health. I mean, mm. I mean, more, more once he could have EXDP'd or something, but he was too scared. Oh, what, what, what a move from Daigo! The classic walk forward, Ume show you. And it's F such a big risk now ultra. as well because on block, like he can ultra two that on block. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, he can on block if yeah. he backdashes. If he backdashes. Yeah. Yeah. What? Wow! These guys are bringing out all of their old characters, Momochi for so long tried to win a ton of majors with Cody couldn't quite do it got no, to so many grand there. finals I think he won one uh, and and we haven't seen his Cody since preferring the matchup here is such a good matchup this I mean these two it's kind of a slugfest I love the way this matchup goes so this should be fun unfortunately we're only going to get one game guys that's yeah Daigo's going to apply a bit more of a Offensive game. Nice pressure, and Cody does so much damage when he gets up close. Oh! Beautiful. Forward medium punch, confirmed. Such a clever pick so far here from Momochi. Who would have predicted this? Oh, oh and he goes straight with the EX criminal. Face it out! And we're not even seeing Momochi do the silent rocks. No. He's just doing standard rocks. I think Daigo might be a bit thrown off here. He wouldn't have anticipated this. Suddenly playing against Momochi. I think, the only, thing, I think Cody. the only thing more shocking this would be Momochi picking like Akuma again or something. <laughs> <laughs> Taking it way back. But there's one guy who doesn't really lose to Akuma's other than infiltration. It's Daigo. Oh, big jump, jump in. Oh, follow through. Link, but Red focus. He no, he's going to go straight for the link. What a follow up. Still has two meters. Daigo jumping away. That's huge. Good punish. Nice overhead. It's match point Momochi, and he's got a life lead too. Momochi's relentless with this pressure. Absolutely relentless. The Cody players must be going absolutely crazy right now. When was the last time you saw a Cody in any kind of top eight? BJ on chain, maybe? Oh, he's done it. The Cody pick, just too good. And Daigo just couldn't keep him off him at all. Couldn't, he could. Was, couldn't he control him. Couldn't play for a forward on the stick the whole time. Fantastic play from Momochi. Another character that got a walk speed buff, I believe, right? Or am I wrong? Uh, did he, Cody? I thought Cody got a bit of a walk speed increase when. Um, Possibly, I'm not entirely sure there. This person came out. Just fantastic play from both players and so entertaining. And really, 
I mean, it just goes to show you, more than one character is the way to go, man. I mean, these are the best in the world at the moment, and neither of them sticking to one character for this. Fantastic Momochi's, entertainment. Momo Momochi's got like a sack of characters, to be fair. I've seen him pull out. Yeah, he, 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 he is uh, one of the original Toolbox. unspoken 2D fighting game beasts. I mean, he, he, he was quite a quite a formidable force in Third Strike as well in his day. Oh, yeah, definitely. And here he is in uh, Street Fighter 4. He was always the guy that kind of like could beat anyone but didn't really win the majors. And uh, just... just